Hey, what is up, gamers? This is Expo, and welcome back to another video. Guys, today in this video, we will discuss on another non root gaming module, and this module is created to boost device performance and the gaming FPS. As promised, this module is also flashable with both the app Driven and the Qt, but I'll flash by using Qt app. Guys, this module is adopted from RepowerDG open source Telegram channel, but created by me with my own script files, but all credit goes to them. And you can also join their telegram channel to get latest update so let me tell you what are the features of this module guys in this module i have added a rendering layer of skia opengl 3.0 for better optimization disable gpu throttling speed to get stable performance disable ksm and the uksm to optimize ram management and the clear cache to release more space also added a script to reduce heating issue UI liquid smooth script performance mode script for your gaming and the multitasking and the FPS booster script file. So these are the many script files which I have added in this module and there is also other script files added to boost your FPS and the performance. I explained only particular script files. So guys if you also want to boost or stable FPS while playing games then I highly recommend to flash this module and this module doesn't require any root permission. You can flash on any Android devices. So guys let me tell you how you can flash this module on your device and I'll flash this module using Qt app but you can also flash this module on Prevent app. But guys before moving on this video make sure to like on this video and also subscribe this channel to get more amazing videos for your Android. Okay guys, so first of all download all the app by which you are going to flash this module. It could be Qt or a Vivian app but I am flashing this module in the Qt app so this app is already installed in my device. After you install the app, also download the module files from the given link name as FPS Stabilizer Tweaks and here we will get FPS Tweaks for Vivian app and the FPS Tweaks for Qt app. Now what you need to do is first go to the internal storage and here create new folder and the folder name should be fps in capital letter after creating folder go back to the extracted folder and here choose your module which one you are going to flash like i will flash module in the qt app so simply copy or cut the module of qt app then go to the internet storage the new created fps folder and here simply paste the module file like this now next step is to flash this module now simply open the qt or a vpn app and guys the command is same for both the apps so don't be confused add same command in the prevent app too after open qt app allow all the permission if you are using this app for the first time then add the command in the command sections guys do not add wrong command otherwise module will not work so watch carefully the command and the add same command in your qt app so the module flashing command is sh space slash storage slash emulated slash zero slash fps in capital letter then slash then fps tweaks dot sh so this is the command watch carefully after adding command tab here to flash the module because the module flashing process has been started it may take few seconds to complete so please wait Guys here you can see I have also added a script file to reduce the heating issue. This one is really useful script if you are facing heating issues while playing games. Okay guys the module has been flashed successfully and the guys you don't need to reboot or restart your device after flashing this module and you can directly open your game. There's so many viewers ask me how to remove module after applying guys if you want to remove this module then simply reboot or restart your device all your applied module will be removed. So this was the easy method to apply this module using Qt app. I hope this video and the module would be useful for you. If you also want to use this module then all the links are provided. You can download from there and try it once and please let me know in the comment section whether it's working or not. And guys if you have any queries or questions then you can DM me in Instagram and join my telegram channel to stay updated. So that's all for today. See you next video. Till then take care and signing out.